Okay, guys, so welcome back. In the last episode, we... Oh, I think we tried to... De we defeated our rival. Now we're here in... Oh, I can't remember the name of the city. Oplicid? Oplicity City? I don't know. If you come and talk to this guy, he'll teach you the best dragon-type move in the game. Draco Meteor. Which is very nice. Yeah, I like that. Let me just... Yes, I will be fine for getting hyperbeam, because it's not proving useful lately. No, seriously, look at my past, like, three, four episodes. It has not proved useful. Cool. Hmm. So now we're going to fly to uh, Mistralton? Yeah, Mistralton City. Fly there. Because I hope I'm planning, yeah, one to two legendaries in this episode. Depending on how lucky we get. I hope we get really lucky because I, I would love to catch two. You guys remember this round? I kept falling off. And then now you're gonna come up here. Oh, I never got that. Wow. Oh, it's a sh fungus. I am a fungus. Oh, I don't even remember who does that. Video. I don't want it. I, I liked Fungus very early on, but then when I started playing the game, I didn't really care for him that much. I found him an interesting concept early on, though. Oh my gosh, I'm having so much positioning problems right now. Because, like, nothing's wanting to stay. Okay, let me just... Okay, there we go. Hopefully. So now what you're going to want to do is you want to climb this tower. I'm going to real quick go to my bag and grab a... Oh, what's it called? I think a rappel? Oh, yeah. It's got to be a rappel. I just... Don't... I think I know i got to have some. Oh, there it is. I know I bought those sometime through this Let's Play. Of course, I haven't fought anyone in this... I know I had to go through here, but, oh my gosh, I don't even... I don't remember it for the life of me. I don't remember who I fought, who I didn't. Yeah, whatever. I'll still be able to take you out in a minute. Yeah, I will, yeah, in the last episode, I said, oh, I'll be fighting a trainer this episode. Uh, yeah, that's not gonna happen. Let's say I'm still very under level to fight this trainer. I reckon have men having Pokemon in their 70s slash 80s. Probably have fought that nurse, but whatever. I think there's only one more town where... Yeah, I think this is either the last floor or something like that. Maybe, no, maybe this is the last one. No, I was wrong. Wait, what? Give me a map. It's not again. Oh, 
Oh, wow, I'm an idiot. Well, okay, then I'm an idiot. We'll come back here later. Trust me. But I totally forgot to do something. We'll do that later, okay? We have something that we'll do, but we'll do it. We'll come back here later, okay? So, yeah, if you did that, just know we'll come back there later. It's not very useful. I shouldn't have gone there in the first place, but hey. No. I think I've been over on this route. Yeah, I probably have. So see, only after you beat this game can you come in this direction. But only after. And boom, when you come down here, yeah, I keep coming. You can talk to this guy. Hey, I got a deal for you. I'll sell you Magic Heart for five Poke Dollars. It is so worth it. Oh, son of a gun! I wanted to buy a Magic Heart. Magic Heart's not my. Magic Heart's by far one of my favorite Pokemon. They are awesome. Okay, remember earlier on, right, I think when we were getting to that cave of element, or some sort of elemental cave, way back when. Oh, uh, no, it wasn't Charged Stone, it was... Give me a minute to research it real quick. The Cave of... Oh, Reversal Mountain. When we were going into Reversal Mountain, on the side, there was this mysterious house that we went by, but we never actually... And we got the Lunar Wing from it. But that was about it. Yeah, we went to the strange house. Right, you guys remember doing that? Well, if you come to this bridge. The lunar wing. It'll ask you if you want. The lunar wing is shining. Do you want to hold it up? Only on. So yeah, if you, go, if you went to that house, you got the lunar wing like I did. Oh, I hated that puzzle. But if you did, you can now come here. Are you, you, you're able to come here after you beat the game. But I don't recommend coming here until after you get the Lunar Wing. This will allow you to summon Cresselius. Now I was planning on catching a different Legendary this episode, but this still works. I, let's see, it's weak to, things that are super effective on it are Bug, Ghost, and Dark, and things that will gradually take it down are Fighting and Psychic, so, as long as I slowly try, okay, I may try to do something a little bit more effective, that's why I saved. Oh yeah, this will be fine for a little bit, this is Cresselia, the Pokemon of Dreams? Or just the moon. I don't remember which one. Well, it uses the lunar wing, and lunar means moon in... Uh... Spanish, is it? Where Lu Luna... I know Luna is moon in Spanish. Is Luna moon in Spanish? I don't know. Lunar, lunar orbit, all that stuff. Kerbal Space Program getting into a lunar orbit around the moon. Oh, I love that game. Oh, wow. I'm just trying to weaken it currently. It's very powerful, man. Oh, oh yeah, I've been playing um, Pearl. I'm trying to catch them all. I've never done that before. I've never, I think the closest I've ever gotten is, oh, diamond, I've got a good, son of a gun, this happens to me all the time, whenever you don't need a critical hit, it happens, oh, it sucks, it's the worst, you don't need a critical hit, and yet you get one. I'm trying to think, anything else we can do for this?
I'll show you guys. I'll show you guys the transfer, but maybe we'll enter Black City, depending on how we do. Hmm. Yeah, we probably will enter Black City, but I don't know. I don't. Or what? No, it's not Black City. I mean White Tree Hall. Never mind. Yeah, we'll probably do that, but then we'll end it. I don't plan on this being like a really long one. Wait, it's not February. Yes, I do. Thank you more. Luna. Luna. I don't remember. I don't remember. Okay, this time we have to gradually weaken its health a little bit smarter. Yeah, smarter seems the word. Maybe I'll try a different move on it to see if I can do some more damage to get to lower it a little bit faster, because... I don't know. I'm gonna try Flare Blitz. I don't even- I never remember using this move. Most of this Let's Play I haven't. I don't know, I need a better fi I need a better fighting move. Okay, if I can get one more Flamethrower on it, I'll be fa- I'll be happy. Wow, that did a lot! But something that it slow- that will slowly do damage to it. Psychic! I don't think I have a... S ah, I got Verizian, and he's got... And Verizian! Ver Verizian, I'm gonna call him. Yeah, Verizian. She's got, like, my best fighting type move, Sacred Sword. I think only her and, like, two others can learn it. Okay, I'm gonna try to catch him. I'm gonna... I still have that Master Ball. We're not even gonna... I don't even know when I'm going to use that. Because, see, most legendaries in the game is like, oh, they can't... Does Moonlight restore health? It does. Oh, this is going to be a pain to catch. I know it. Is that... It's in... No, it's Bug that's super effective. Never mind. Oh, I'm going to hate catching. Oh, of course, because it's, uh... I don't even know how many times it can use that lunar move or whatever. But, oh, that's gonna suck for me. Moonlight. Oh, this move. It restores its health. Which sucks, because I'm trying to catch it. It was like, oh, when catching Verizon. All it knew, all it was doing... Or was that Kabolian? One of them was a pain to catch because it kept restoring health or kept doing something stupid that just kept annoying me. Giga Drain doesn't even have that much PP on it, which is so cool. I'll probably do it one more time. At least I'm keeping constant health. Oh, but it's not dead. I would love to put it to sleep, but I don't have... I would love to... Not burn it. Burn it would be horrible. I love to conf... No, not conf... I'd love to paralyze it. Burn's too risky. Yeah, burn... Being, putting on a burn would be way too risky. Thank goodness I can take hits, though. Ew. Huh. Usually Pokeballs always do the trick for me. I don't know how long this takes. It's gonna suck if it takes forever. Like uh, Verizon did. It was just that attempt to catch it. I didn't even plan on using it. Until I tried to catch it. It was when I tried to catch it, which I knew. Oh, it's going on my team. It was just its devotion. I had never had a Pokemon take that long to catch in all my year. Runner-up, I think, was probably Regice. Oh, Regice, I used... 
Oh. 40, 50 Ultra Balls on. Reggie Rock, I used like 30. Reggie, I, I think by that point, I'd ran out of money or something like that. By the time I'd gotten to Reggie um, Rock, or Reggie Steel, so I was just using like 100 Pokeballs, caught in like two. My most rough, my best, that's my best story Pokemon, was the time I caught Reggie Ice with just two Pokeballs. Oh, that was the most triumphant day. This is going to be pain, isn't it? Cyber uh, <gasps> Mischievous counter. Deflecting moves went up by one. Anybody who gets that reference gets ten points. I would love to establish a website just with, like, these random point systems in it. That would be so much fun, I would think. Because I do that all the time. I just quote other YouTubers. Son of... Hmm... Of course, you're, you can full, oh my gosh, oh. I hope this doesn't kill you, if I, if it does, think, it didn't. Should be super effective, I don't know which. Um, as long, as long as it doesn't flee, oh, that would be the worst. I don't think there are any Pokemon like that in this game, that'll just like, fly away like you only get one chance and then it'll fly away i don't think there are any like that in this game which i uh, like that was always the worst thing about oh what was it emerald ruby sapphire i don't remember one of those games it was horrible Yeah, I, I know, I remember Entei and Gold and Silver, that runaway. I remember Latios and La- or Entei, was it Entei or Raikou? Or was it- yeah, it was Entei and Raikou that ran away in Gold and Silver. That was horrible. Then it was- oh, uh, I don't think- No, Zapdos and Moltres didn't. Neither did Articuno, because they couldn't, they were inside the caves. The other one was Latios and Latios. Oh yeah, and Misprit, Azelf, and I think I know Misprit did. I don't think Azelf or Uxie did, but I think I think Misprit did in um Diamond and Pearl. She ran away, but not the other two. I don't think. I was like, what did I? T Pokeballs are amazing. They usually are for me. Ugh, I hate that move. It's great. But it's just, I'm trying to catch you. And I thank goodness it's not a good dark move. So it doesn't do that much to, like, kill it. And watch me get a critical. That would be the worst thing ever. I'm gonna hate catching this thing, ain't I? Always happens. Always. It's already been long. I've been fighting this thing for at least eight minutes now. Maybe even more. I kinda lost track. one of the most annoying things. And of course, this is all I have. No. Because other, like, besides Dark Balls, maybe? And other types of Pokeballs have never really helped. Dark Balls. Ugh. I hate catching this thing. If time goes up to it, I'll just, if, t yeah, if time comes up, I'll just catch it off camera. Uh, I would, if I, if I kill it, again, I'm gonna catch it off camera, cause, oh, that is the most annoying thing ever, just trying to catch a legendary. 
Oh, they were just too hard. I'm afraid it's gonna kill itself, like, um, Verizon. I fought it for so long. It killed itself twice. Oh, that is the worst thing when it stops shaking and it's you think it's gonna be caught and then guess what? Nope, Chuck Testa oh. Love to I hate having that master ball because I'll know I'll use it eventually. I just don't know when See, I think it really has to shake, like, immediately, or maybe two seconds after the attack. Or other than that, it's not gonna work. But I think that's how... I would love to get a critical catch on a Legendary. I've never even seen a critical catch. Well, okay, I, I have, but I've never gotten one. And they were introduced in this game or the last game? I don't remember, but that would be great to get a critical catch. long this takes. Oh my gosh. Oh, I'm on. And there goes... Oh, I was gonna expect... There he goes. I think it's run out of Moonlight or whatever that move was called. He's not using it anymore, which I like. Real quick, I'm going to use a HP, not HP Restore, I mean a Revive to bring back Rock a lot because it it lasted very long out there. Maybe it's because Psycho Cut didn't affect it. That's why it was lasting so long. I don't know. One. <sighs> oh. It's just like, it's cat- I know the lower health it has, the higher cat rate it has. But sometimes that just doesn't feel the case. Like I think I swear I've been able to catch Quasas at full health, but I've been unable to catch Pokemon at like like Verizon at red health. Oh, that was it. Verizon. He kept using Giga Drain to restore its health. That's what I found annoying. That's it. Yeah, not whatever its name's, uh... Well, I've almost ran out. I just want to catch it and end this. <sighs> I hate when you get nothing. That's probably the worst. So yeah, Psycho Cut doesn't affect Krokorov. And I know it will eventually run out of moves, which... One, two, three... Uh, that's, hap that's probably the fifth time that's happened. I'm not keeping track, so... Don't quote me on that. Maybe I've been the third, but... Feels like that's already happened a lot in this battle.
And then, boom, I have to... I feel like once you get that good streak, once it fails, it, re it pretty much restarts. That's so annoying. Yeah, boom, once you get a good streak up. Why don't trainers in the TV show have this type of problem? They can just throw a pogo, and boom, it's caught. But no, here in the game, we ha it's a pain to catch anything. One, two, three. And now, now it's not going to even shake the next time. It's a critical, of course. Of course it is. All I have left is this stupid AV. Should have bought a magic card. This is gonna take out the Eevee in like one hit. How oh, you suck. Volume just turned down. I did just turn it down a little bit. It's late at night, guys. It sucks. See, what did I tell you? On my next ball, I use nothing. Ugh, that's the most aggravating thing. I'm, I'm hoping it'll just run out of Psycho Cut. Mm, but I'm guessing it has like 30 PP. One. Nothing. Come on, I want to catch this thing now. I'm running out of Ultra Balls. See, after a fail, I'm pretty sure it like resets or your catch rate just decreases by a bunch. That's what I feel like. I'm gonna bring back someone, of course, to protect me. I was gonna have that back, so just in case. This should last us a little bit longer. Need more health. One time I restore my health, boom, guess what? You get a critical. So now, boom. All that, that potion I've used was 90% useless. So you destroyed half my health in just one hit. Now that's what I'm talking about. It is only going to get unfair, maybe another two minutes. I hate catching a wild... Legendaries. This is the worst part of the game. One, two, three. It never, they just never want to catch. You try and they just don't want to. I want to use my Master Wolf, but it's not worth it. And then boom, it resets. Like I, th I swear that's... I'll catch it. I'll catch it tomorrow. Or in off camera. But peace out.